Okay, I think it's finally time. I mean, uh, everything else seems to be stuff that we do later, so might as well do final preparations, finally. Um, I repaired all my gear and stuff, so why not? Final preparations is over here, so we'll go over there. But yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'll probably fail some quests, but at this point, I'm just wanting to oh. see... What? What, what happens basically it's like we've done a lot of preparations already there's a couple of quests like there's an assassination thing but i don't want to assassinate anybody that's not what the witch is around about <laughs> it's it says i agreed to the assassination of radovid i never agreed to that i don't remember agreeing to that so yeah it's a bit weird Let's see. Help Siri take care of her business in Novigrad. Ah, there's Siri. Looking for something in particular? Um, a pretty little trinket. Want to give someone a present? One of the people I told you about. A gesture of gratitude. That's nice. Can we go? Lead the way. We need to go to Temple Isle. Don't remember you being religious? Nor am I now. Let's go. Okay. Almost there. Where are we going exactly? To see Horson Jr. Hmm. Did I kill him? I can't remember. Bit late for that. He's dead. I asked Sultan, and he said Horson's alive and well on Temple Isle. I was there, stuck a sword in his gut. Your hand must have slipped, because it seems he's recovered. Oh, okay. Fair enough then. <laughs> Why are you doing this again? I want to look him in the eyes. What then? I don't know. Depends what I see. Hmm. What? Here to see Mr. Wiley. Mr. Wiley's expecting important guests. So bugger off. You. <laughs> you. <laughs> Chance! <laughs> oh, we don't have delusion level three. Hmm. Yeah, we don't have that. Here I thought we could do this the nice way. Out of the way, you louts. Or we'll cut up your mug so the girls at Cripple Kate's won't even have you. What do you say? Didn't understand. Too many syllables. Fuck off. Oh, you little bitch. <laughs> Bad idea. <laughs> I love that. Classic screaming sound effect. Burn, baby, burn. say Geralt? Geralt who? Of fucking Rivia. <laughs> well, why did you say that from the get-go? <laughs> Sorry to hassle you. <laughs> Misunderstanding that <laughs> Mr. Wiley's expecting you. That was hilarious. I set him on that fire. And... Strange. Yes. To say the least. <laughs> I wonder what they're doing. We'll know soon enough. I, like set them on fire and he's like fine. But yeah, I'm expecting like a bunch of quest fails because like we didn't do a thing, but I'm not bothered, you know. Like Carol doesn't do political shit. He just doesn't. So we'll see what happens. Well well. Who do we have here? It's a me. Get out found of your little ward. Took your sweet fucking time. Seems in fine health to me. Ah, because you thought you killed me that time. Surprise the fucking prize. Shut your trap, witch. Before somebody fills that owl for you. Enough. I'll finish what you started. Whoa, whoa, stop. It's me, Dudu. Dudu Bieberfeld. You really didn't recognize me. Dudu? <laughs> Wait, Siri. 
After the heist, after Dijkstra's vault was emptied, you vanished. How'd I find you? Quick. Butcher's yard, the mama's plate, Priscilla's. You dragged me onto the stage. Sheathe your sword, Siri. It's doo doo. God, you give me quite the scare. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't have had to if you hadn't impersonated Horson. What the blazes were you thinking? Once we'd fled, I'd no idea what to do. I could only hide for so long. They'd find me sooner or later. It wasn't our decision. We knew he was dead, but not many others had caught on. That was my chance. No one mourned for Horson Jr. In all his miserable life, he'd never helped a soul. Amusingly, once dead, he became a useful member of society. They say everyone deserves a second chance. Seems true enough. Orson got his, in a way, sharing it with a Doppler named Doodoo. -Doo. That was courageous, Doodoo. -Doo. I'd never expect it from you. Neither would I. Oh, by the way, you've no idea at the relief I feel you're alive and well. And I'm relieved I didn't slit your throat. <laughs> Shows an interesting line of business. Dudu's always had a head for numbers. What's a few brothels and casinos? He'll manage. That's the thing. I don't need to. Two weeks after Wiley died, I announced I'd seen the light of the eternal fire. Sold all the illegal enterprises. I'm a blue water trader now. Horson's men didn't protest. I've contacts in the guilds. Run a thriving trade. Profits are twice what they were before. To Wiley's men, a purse twice as heavy means twice as much respect for the men handing it to them. <laughs> Be careful. You could get found out. Wiley's men are too stupid to catch on. His colleagues ain't much better. Mind you, even you were fooled. And that might have ended very badly for you. True. I get a bit carried away at times. But mostly I'm careful. Time's up. Right. We must still go by the Golden Sturgeon. It was nice to see you both. And take care of yourselves. You too. So long, Dudu. Why are we going to the Sturgeon? To see a girl who helped me once. Who might that be? Friends of Dandelions. Her name's B. She's a waitress at the Golden Sturgeon. Helped me contact Dandelion. Oh. I will wish to thank her. How do you find Novigrad? She risked a lot. Risked a lot? How's that? The Temple Guard were breathing Whoa. down my neck. If she'd been seen with me, she might have been flogged or worse. Always getting into trouble. I take after you. The fresh fish. What's this? Fresh fish. You call this fresh? An abomination. Honor and I visited a city once that was very much like Novigrad, but the people there were much taller and had dark skin. This somewhere in Zerakania? No, in another world. Hmm. What's it like hopping between worlds? Anything like passing through a portal? Or different? Mm, a bit different. It was hard going at first. I wasn't very good at controlling it, so I had to concentrate intensely and hope I didn't land in the crater of an active volcano. The training I did with Avalok was very helpful. Now, I merely think of the place I wish to travel to, close my eyes, and it's done. Quite a run there, isn't there? We could take the horse. <laughs> yeah, I wonder where we're going after this. I don't even know. I'm not sure. I don't remember agreeing to go anywhere. <laughs> Gave you a chance. Should have taken it. I spit on anything you give me. You'll regret that, Oof. you cow. Mind your manners, you're talking to a lady. Stay out of this. This is not your concern. <laughs> Shh. 
Sure it is. You're a fucking freak too. He is. Very dangerous at that. The butcher of White Orchard. What'd he do there? Trim the trees? Eugen. He slew half the village. Dragged the bodies of the alderman and his wife behind his horse to Novigrad. Let's get out of here. That's pretty good advice your friend's offering. S sorry <laughs> Thank you. They seem more determined this time. You shouldn't cross them, I told you. I'm to bar non-humans from this establishment because some thugs threaten me. Not likely. It's so good to see you, B. And you, Siri. Who's your charming companion? <laughs> Render of the drown drum. <laughs> Geralt of Rivia. <sighs> that Geralt! <laughs> Very nice to meet you. I've heard so much. <laughs> what have you heard? Really? What, for example? For example, how you've saved her from woes so many times she's lost count. And how you always know how to make her laugh. <laughs> That's Siri, of course. Other ladies, however. B, I'm standing right here. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. So, what brings you here, darlings? I wanted to thank you for everything. Oh, stop. Anyone would have done the same in my shoes. Not many would have done it with such courage. Thank you. This is for you. A trinket to remember me by. Oh, my. It's beautiful. Thank you. So, will you stay for stew? And keep slaughtered a piglet this morning? Thanks. But we must still visit Far Corners. Ah, off to see Valdo, eh? Well, shan't stop you then. They'll feed you properly there too, no doubt. Farewell to you both. And do take care of our witcher. I will. So long. Oh, nice, we're dinged. Which that means works. we can use these. Though, I... Yeah, they are better. That's a better steel sword. Is that better? Yeah, that's a better sword as well. Kind of. The sign intensity isn't as good, but... It's got three... I don't know, this one's kind of... It's just better damage overall. This one's like... Hmm. I do kind of want to use these, though, so... Uh, the silver, silver. Need to uh, armed and dangerous unlocked. Nice achievement. Yeah, I don't. I need to uh, get some better glyphs sometime, but it's not that important. Um. Oh yeah, can't put that on there. I don't have any glyphs. Oh yeah, I've got some glyphs. What we got. I need a 5% chance to cause burning. 2% is just terrible. I do like my burning now. Ooh, 30% armor piercing. That'd be good for steel, would not it? Chance to stun, chance to freeze, chance to sagger. Like my burning. Five percent attack power. Mm. I'll do for now. I've material so, for another balance. Your friend B. What about her? Nothing. Seems nice. Geralt. You're terrible. What I say. What's there to see? What did he say? <laughs> oh yeah, I need to put a point in. That's what I was going to do. Uh, what should we put a point into? We've already maxed out this pretty much. Um, yeah, we need six points in the branch, which was is what we have. 
Yeah. That's three of three active shield. Which we have. And we also have, uh, yeah, we also have exploding shield. Active shield. Maintaining shield no longer drains stamina. Yeah. Yeah, I don't, I don't get what this is about. I need additional points in branch needed. Additional points in branch needed to unlock six. Three and three. Points in branch. Oh, right. Okay, so. It's like points in general, I guess. Hmm. What else can we increase? Oh, I did have delusion three. Huh. Increases sign duration, that might be good. This is that is that just Urden though? Yeah, I think it's like Urden sign duration. Uh, what's this? Melt armor with Igni. Well, I seem to be picking this puppet and then intensity and then domination. A magic trap would be good too. Yeah, it's on 13 now, so for this I now need five more to unlock this one. Far corners. The camp of some traveling circus before us. Non-humans. When I came here before, I wanted to contact Triss. Life was hard. I quickly spent nearly everything the Baron gave me. Triss and I never met, because the Temple Guard showed up. I was a wanted woman afterwards. Triss didn't try to contact you? How could she? She didn't know anything. In fact, she thought she was to meet another alchemist wanting to flee Novigrad. I preferred not to put her in danger. I was being hunted. Had not a copper to my name. Then I met Valdo. He and his troop helped me. Then introduced me to B. And through B, I found Dandelion. You know the rest. Where's this friend of yours? Siri, you devil incarnate, where have you been? Come here, darling. Hello, what's this? Brought your granddad? Agar, you're incorrigible. Allow me to introduce Geralt of Rivia. Ah, greetings. We've heard heaps about you. <laughs> <laughs> Likewise, and thanks for helping Siri. Oh, we had no choice. Found it hard to refuse a lass like her. Well, good you're here. Come in the nick of time. Would have been gone by tomorrow. You're leaving? Better start resettling non-humans shortly. We'd rather stay ahead of events. I understand. Problem is, we just lost two horses, and another two are too weak to haul anything. Ah, we'll manage somehow. We don't leave till tomorrow, so naught to worry about today. Yes, for some. I'm off to see a merchant. There's a chance I can trade our nags for a healthy horse. Wouldn't want Valdo to have anything to worry about tomorrow. Hmm. What's eating him? Oh, don't worry. That's just how Agar is. Be back to his jolly old self by evening. What brings you here? I've come to apologize. I disappeared so suddenly, then... Ah, oh, pish posh. What matters is you're back, and you're well. 
This is for you. All that you loan me, plus a small premium. Siri, you know I can't take this. And you know I shan't let you refuse. Hmm. I know. We'll make it the pot for a wager. <laughs> Do you still race? Of course. Then I challenge you. Geralt, will you join us? Gladly. A man after my own spirit. <laughs> Come. Are we going to be racing? Oh dear. <laughs> Geralt, choose one of these. Coming, coming. This boat's ill. Ill, I say. Okay. You were faster once! Giving you a head start! <laughs> like all of a sudden, the horse race. Oh god, I crashed already. That's the trouble if you clip something, you slow down really fast. Faster. Oh you're god. Trailing. Watch where you're going or you'll fall. Forgotten how to do this, to be honest. Ah. <laughs> Seems you've slowed. Just want to admire you from the side. I know they're going to rubber band past me anyway, so might as well slow down a bit. Oh, gone the wrong way. Ah! <laughs> I can't believe that happened. Oops. Oh well. On form and fast as ever. Oh well. Let's Siri race. win. <laughs> Thanks. Truly swift, this mare. The swiftest horse is worth no more than a mule without a good rider. Well, this calls for a celebration. Stay the evening. We've several barrels of Kedwin's best. Bonfires to be lit soon, round which all will gather. This night shall be ours. Had to throw the wet race and let Siri win, you see. <laughs> <laughs> Worked out nicely, don't you think? What are you talking about? You and Triss. Never expected it, to be honest. Life's full of surprises. So, how did the two of you... End up together? <laughs> With Yen, it was fight after fight. Lots of arguments, drama. Not saying it was bad, but... But what? Got to be exhausting. With Triss, it's not. I finally feel... Harmony. A calm. Feel like things are the way they're supposed to be. More wine? Thanks. I'm glad we stayed. Me too. They like you here. I like them too. Oh, I'd love to join them. Drink and race, travel from town to town. Not worry a whit about anything. Oh. So, we learned two things here. We learned that Gerald is very happy with Triss as a choice, which is awesome, and it feels right, which is awesome to hear. We're on the right track there, but we're hearing that Siri wants to be carefree. So that's kind of contrary to becoming an empress. So, yeah. Yeah. So, her becoming an empress is probably a bad idea. Hmm. Good plan, then, I guess. <laughs> that's just what she wants to do. Good plan. I think I'll go with you. Then our future's settled. If that is, there's more than Ash left of us once this is over. Defeating the hunt won't be easy, but with the Lodge's support, Avalax, we can do this. I fear fighting the hunt will only be the beginning. For me, at least. What do you mean? <laughs> you promised! In jest? Sometimes I wish I could be like them. <laughs> Me too. Being a witch is a burden sometimes. As is my inheritance. I'd so like to be ordinary. Hmm. Your life is yours exclusively. You choose who you are. Uh, Geralt. 
You know that's never been true. All because of this damned elder blood. My gift. My curse. It granted me all of these powers, but it's also why I've spent my life fleeing, hiding. Then it's time to end this. Once we defeat Eredin, you'll be free. Really? Eredin's hardly alone. There are others. They have plans for me. It was the sorceresses of the Lodge once. Now it's my father. Even Yennefer. You're forgetting Avalach. Avalach's different. He is intent on my gift not falling into the wrong hands. Not spinning out of control. It's why he teaches me, protects me. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. The sooner you get rid of that illusion, the better. What do you mean? There'll come a day when Avalok will ask you for a favor. Perhaps. But if so, it will be a very, very long time from now. And I'm certain whatever it is, he'll give me a choice. I will have the option to refuse. Hope you're right. That's Pablo. I plan to learn how to juggle one day. Incredibly useful skill. Finally found you two. Enjoying yourselves. <laughs> Bonfires, wine, jugglers, what more could you ask for? I could name a few things I'd trade it for, but it's a life. You seem concerned. Things not go well with the merchant. <laughs> Lost cause. The man refused to trade. I said I'd buy. He asked three arms and a host of legs for one healthy animal. We need horses, but we'll have to find another way to get them. Ho, ho, I sense trouble. I knew you'd warm to the notion. We mean to sneak into the man's stable. With 30 head, a few more or less won't make a difference in his life. Coming with? Of course. We'll meet by the stables. Oh, it decided to go ahead with the dialogue without me. Oh well. Looks like we're stealing some horses, I guess. Yeah, I tried to pause it, but it was like, nope. Oh well. I think we'll leave it off here, guys. Look out. Siri and I'll try to get inside. All right. If we can. Yeah, I think we can leave it off here, guys. Unfortunately, we're out of time, but uh, it's nice to uh, do a bit more of the main storyline. I didn't expect all this. I thought we were going to go straight into the major stuff. It looks like we're doing a little bit of side stuff uh, beforehand, which suits me. It's really good. It's nice we leveled up. I got to uh, use the two new swords I made for myself. I'll just have another look at them. Uh, the mastercrafted uh, wolf swords, especially that I wanted to make, which are very nice. I mean, they're 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 not like a huge upgrade, but it, the damage is a is a nice upgrade. So I definitely wanted to get the old, the whole green set for for the end. But yeah, the, we haven't got much left. Um, we've got that one quest to kill the king, but I'm not going to do that because. It doesn't make any sense for Geralt to do an assassination. Uh, it says we agreed to it, but I, d I don't remember agreeing to that. And if I did, I shouldn't have. So I'm, I'm just going to let that fail, I think. <laughs> I, I guess that means the king wins. And if he wins, it's not good for the people and stuff. But it's not good if Nilfgaard takes over either. You know, <laughs> it's like since since I started this game, I've watched the TV series and I, I know more of the Witcher lore and I know how shit Nilfgaard is so you know they're pretty good at ruling but they're not very good at like you know they're quite cruel in war so I'm of two minds about that and, and now we know Ciri does not want to be the Empress like she's pretty much said as much so it's pretty much duty so yeah it's it I'm gonna try and wing it like she she gets to choose what she wants to do basically and and hopefully you know whatever she chooses is you know it's the right ending uh i think that's the best thing to do it's like at first you're like kind of like oh i wanted to get this ending this ending but then it's like mm, but what, what does she want and she seems to want to be like either a witcher or she just wants to be carefree 
So I think that would be a good ending for Siri in the end. So let's see if we can make that happen or whether it's all going to fall apart. We'll have to see. Anyway, till next time, guys.